Hello and welcome back everybody to episode 20 of Medieval Dynasty. My name is Lainey from Early Gaming and we are now in the spring and faced again with one of these things. It's some sort of choice you have to make and there's never been a good choice. <laughs> this one's especially bad. Um, it was apparently a thief who was caught when he was trying to steal our resources. He tries to make excuses, of course, that he's poor and the sort. Now it's up to us to decide what to do with him. Unfortunately, everything we do will be terrible for us. Number one, we can cut off his hands. Minus 10 mood, minus 50 dynasty. That's disgusting. Number two, order somebody to cut off his hands. And we're going to get minus 20 mood. I, I don't know if we can afford this mood head. I, I don't know if we can. But if we let him loose and banish him, we lose 1 to 5% of our crafting items. I mean, I guess we're rich. All right, let's see what we lost. I I'm most worried if I lost some fertilizer. Okay, three fertilizer, that's not that bad. Some firewood, a linen, okay, salt. I don't care about salt, I don't care about sticks. I don't care about stone. I don't care about straw. Okay, this is not too bad. The wool is sucky, because I, I did only have one wool. <laughs> but yeah, it's fine. Uh, the feather, everything else is fine, to be fair. All right, yeah, this wasn't so bad. I'm glad I didn't pick the mood. That would have been terrible. Uh, we gotta pay our taxes. Okay, that's something I didn't consider. But hello, Sibora, and my beautiful boy. Oh my god. He's still not grown. He's still not good. Now, guys, look how beautiful our town looks in the spring. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it wonderful? Oh, man. I am so, so hyped. Look at our, look at our teammates over here. They're just hanging out. Oh, I like this a lot. This is why I made it. So you guys can have a nice time. Oh, I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased. Uh, they're enjoying the day. They're enjoying the town. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. That's for sure. And our town is a uh, team. It's looking up. You know, the, there's something There's something about the, the swamp. It's not the best place to build, granted. But there's a little bit of magic here. It looks wonderful. It looks woodsy. It looks great. You will notice that this is missing right now. Something happened to our roads. I noticed that during the winter, I had to remake that road over there. And uh, these seem to be okay, but this one seems to have just disappeared completely from here to there. Uh, I don't know, maybe some sort of bug. Uh, maybe it had something to do with their latest patch. And guys, if you don't know, they've changed the sounds to everything. Look at this. Cool, huh? I, I mean, I don't know. I think it sounds so much better. And they've also changed the color of things. You see how it says 100% in green? Um, if it's 0%, it's it's red now. And uh, just a couple of other color things just to make things a little bit more clear. I like it a lot. I think the white was not, not great. It was not great. This is much, much better. So uh, the plan is simple. We have to farm. This spring, we have to farm. Okay, I've gone ahead and made another little baggie so I could plant all of my poop and hopefully some cabbage and some flax. Flax, very much necessary. I need to make some lanterns and some lights for this place and I need an insane amount of flax to do so. So I'm, I'm really, really happy. I hope I'm able to get to sheep at the very least, which is why I'm doing everything myself. Uh, if you guys remember, I went on a four year journey to try to get horses and unfortunately that did not happen. So now I'm just going to hope for sheep, <laughs> at least for sheep by the fall, right? Like, let's just, uh, let's just set that goal. Hopefully it'll work. Hopefully it will. But if it doesn't, then at least we tried. Now I'm going to be using all of my poop, which I have a couple hundred. I do have a nice amount of fertilizer and we have to pay our taxes. Today is going to be an agricultural day. I'm going to plant. I'm going to plow. I'm going to do everything that I need to do to get myself a little bit more agriculture skill. And once I have that, um, I'm going to be so, so happy. I mean, it's really the only thing, well, that and money, let's be real, I'm always broke. But that and money, <laughs> the only things that are stopping me from my horses. Now, both of these fields here, that one and this one, have been plowed and have been fertilized, so they're ready for planting. I've started adding some cabbage here. I just think we're gonna need some food and we definitely don't have any, as well as it's a good way to make money to sell some food. 
Everybody always wants it. They always buy it. And it, it sells for a nice amount. It's not too difficult to carry. You know, overall, a good thing to have. Uh, I think what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to at least do two of these of cabbage. And then I'm going to see if I can make the rest of flax. Flax I need desperately. Desperately. Like I said, we need some lights and, you know, bags and other things we could sell or we could make. So uh, that's the plan now. Uh, you actually need so much flax to make a linen that is a bit ridiculous. So I'm going to go crazy with it. We're going to plant as much as humanly possible. And as soon as I level, I am going to rejoice. Yes. All right. All right. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Oh, I'm so happy. I've, I've gone ahead and done those two patches. So we should be good on that. And now I think, oh, I've been saving a point because I've been really worried that Knight Rider is an absolute must and I still can't get it. So I'm really worried about that, worried that they'll add it as a, you have it, you have to have it to be able to ride horses. And I'm not dealing with that if I can't. Uh, reduces the number of seeds needed to sow. Um, okay, that might not be that bad. We might be able to get more seeds. So that's great. And faster shearing, that would be wonderful if I did have any sheeps yet. And durability loss. I think, I think we'll go with the seeds. I don't know if that's working, uh, but it would be cool to see if it is. And we also have a point in extraction that I haven't put in, so that's good. Uh, we could do woodcutter, but right now it's fine. It's working where I can two-shot the tree. I'm not really too worried about it. I haven't mined in forever. Uh, let's see if there's anything else that maybe I can... Shovel durability loss? <laughs> I mean, that's good. That's good, right? Uh, we have Iron Seeker. Uh, we can't get anything else until we, we put a point here. So there we go. Not bad, guys. We got a, a little bit of a level. I'm just wondering if, I'm, if that means that I'm able to get, to get sheep yet. Am I there? Oh, I'm not there yet. I'm not there yet. I'm, I'm close. I'm close. Only 500 points away. Just keep, keep plowing, guys. Keep plowing. Maybe soon we'll have sheep. Don't mind me, piggies. Hi, little piglet. I'm going to have a bit of water from the pig well. <laughs> not, not disgusting at all. Not disgusting at all. Look at her. Wait a minute. We, we have a, we have two males. They've reproduced again. Oh, but they keep having males. <laughs> I mean, I guess, uh, it is what it is, right? But. Oh, I wish they were ladies. Uh, we can, however, sell one of those. I'm pretty sure that's going to be fine. And it will give us some money. I, I don't know if the little piglet can be sold. Only for 175 Okay, the little piglets don't sell for a lot. Uh, but the big piggies sell for 350 Eh, you know. I have the room, so I might, I might as well. Okay, so I have the hog and three pig ladies here and an extra slot for a baby. Hopefully they'll have a girl this time. And we have the two piglets here with a pig lady because she's just an extra, just for more poop. And there's a couple more slots here for more babies. Uh, I'm going to need more pig size, I think, guys. And we're going to have to sell the extra boys. Uh, there's just no way that makes sense for me to keep the boys here. Uh, I could wait till they grow. Or I could sell them right about now. But I think I'm just going to wait and see if they grow. Um, they'll sell for three seventy five. That's not too bad. And we're going to be working at another pig sty. Probably one back here. Like, we might as well keep it keep it together. That or we work on another one and we place it right over here. Uh, I don't know where I was planning to place the sheep, I'll be honest, or the cows. At this point, I have no idea. Uh, we need to remake the road over here and then uh, maybe we'll place them here. Or maybe we'll place them over there by the barn. There's plenty of room. It's just I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly where I want to put it. But definitely, I want to work on another pig pen. I think the best bet for it, since I don't need a lot of extra room for the pigs to run around, is maybe just to try to shove one right there. Or maybe a couple of them over there. <laughs> I want a lot of poop. 
Uh, fertilizer is going to be crazy around here. We're going to have so much. But I think, guys, for the rest of the night, I'm just going to continue to plant. Well, we have quite a bit to go. Um, I don't think I'm getting, like, a whole lot of technology, but it is moving up. I, have, I don't know if I'm going to make it. We currently have 2075. We were at 2040 or 2020 when we started, so we do we did get a little bit. But it is still going to be a while for us to get the sheep. So let's not get discouraged. This has to happen during the spring. Planting during the spring is absolutely a must. So I'm going to just keep going, and I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, guys. It's almost morning of day two. And I think I'm going to do something crazy. I have shoveled up one of these stumps. And we're going to add another farm. Uh, I, maybe I'm going crazy. I don't know. But I think it's probably worth it. And my only concern is this farm here across. Looks like it's... Looks like it's at least four high. One, two, three, four. Yeah, this is not four. Is this one? No, maybe it's four. So two... Three, four, five. There we go. And it should be the same as that one. Maybe the same as this one. Yeah, it looks like it is. And I'm going to do a whole nother farm. The reason why I'm doing this, well, not only is it to actually, uh, you know, get the farm going. But also because I, I have a little bit more fertilizer. And I figured, why not, guys? You know, <laughs> It's, it's it's one of those seasons where I definitely need to get as much as I can done. I have planted an obscene amount of stuff. That's the only thing that's worrying me a bit. I, I think I might have gone a little bit crazy. I don't know. I, I've even considered saving this spot here for an animal and maybe planting more farms up the hill here. Because it is harder to put buildings up the hill. So maybe this would be a good spot for a building. Uh, but since I have no other building to place, once I get the rest of the animals, I'll figure it out. But for now, I think it's it's still fine to use this. So you'll notice I have just a little bit, just a little bit more fertilizer. I have planted all of the fields last night. I finished them all so that we have at least four here and then another three here. And there was uh, some wheat and stuff that was already planted there. So I don't have to worry about that. Plus, I planted those 40 over there as well, that big field that we have back there it's 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 a little nuts okay i'm going to i'm going to accept it but i think it's absolutely necessary today i'm going to grab as much of the stuff that i have to sell whatever i can find to sell and we're going to go to town and we're going to sell it we're going to see if we can pay our taxes that would be pretty nice to get out of the way and uh we'll see if we can make a little bit more fertilizer or if this is it are we done uh let's see let's see did i grab the manure i have 36 and I think that will let us make just a bit more. Yeah, 18 more. All right. Okay, guys, I grabbed a few things. Hopefully enough to sell. But our taxes are mighty, team. Okay? $29.90. Unicos is an absolute thief. Just a barbarian. And so we're going to head over there. Hopefully we'll be able to... Why is she all the way over here? I don't even want to know. Hopefully we'll be able to sell some stuff here. Uh, I'm going to stop by this first town. Because I don't actually think I have enough enough stuff to sell. I just don't think I have enough to make enough money. Um, so we're going to do this. Maybe we'll take on a quest. That might give us some money. But either way, I, I don't know if it's worth it. It might be better off for us to go back home. And just make a bunch of like stone knives and things like that. To try to survive. But uh, even then... Uh, we're a bit broke. We need to wait till this garden finishes. Uh, hopefully, they'll give us enough cabbage to make pottage for days. And uh, that should be pretty good. As well as the flax might come in handy. It really might. All right. Let's see. Hello, lady. Please buy my stuff. Please, I beg you. <laughs> take all my pottage. Take all my soup. 1900. That's still not going to do it. And most of my knives. I still don't think that's going to do it. No. Twenty-two ninety. Oh, we are so far behind. That is so far. Oh, we're still wearing fur. Uh, it's probably not very good. But, yep. Still not there, guys. Still not there. I'm gonna have to do some stuff. Let's see if there's a... Oh, there it is. We have one quest right away. Hopefully, it'll be for some good stuff. Alright, it's for a recursive bow. So, um, unfortunately, that's not gonna happen. It also doesn't give me any money. So, super not worth it for me, at least not at the moment. Uh, the quests seem to have gotten a lot more difficult, but I, I don't even have the skill to get these things. 
maybe they think I can buy it, but it only gives me like 15 dynasty reputation and it gives me 200 crafting skill or something like that, which I feel like it's not enough. It's just not enough for the cost of the item that I'm giving them. So uh, we'll see. We'll see. For now, I just want to get back home. I'm going to craft more things since I don't have enough. And then we're going to go pay our taxes. Hopefully, we'll have time. All right. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot to sell. I don't know. I don't know what my people are doing. Maybe I just need more humans. Something like that. But I'm going to make a little bit of roasted meat today. And I'm hoping that maybe I can use that and the onions to make myself some stew and sell the stew. That or I can sell the roasted meat. It doesn't actually matter. I just need things to sell. I made stone knives and I guess that's what I'm going to go sell right now. My taxes will be paid. But it's a little bit sad how broke I am after so many years. I don't really understand how people make this much money. I, I don't I don't get it. I mean, I guess now things are a little bit better now that I have my fertilizer and all of that. But it still feels like I'm struggling every year and I, I don't make enough. What I'm going to focus on, though, is um, maybe I'll start looking into uh, certain people that I'm trying to target so I can turn them into my followers. Um, I need to make more homes for them, all of that. But we'll work on that on a different season. This season is pretty pretty jam-packed. I, I don't know why they put the taxes to be due on the, on the spring. I get it. It's like a it's like a yearly thing. So it's a, it's a very busy season. And so I'm trying to do my best here. I'm going to finish this up. And then hopefully we'll still have time to make it uh, to town. It's only half day, so we should have plenty of time. Let's get this done and then head out. Okay, I sold what I could to Ida, but it's gotten a bit late as you can see. Let's see if there's anybody here who is worth talking to. I mean, right now I think I'm looking for a crafter. Um, a hunter, I don't know if I need a hunter, but a farmer is also good and that guy's a three. That's not too bad at all. Well, let's talk about the weather. All right. How have you been? Okay, he likes that. He likes that. My approval seventy percent. Oh. Do I just take him? I mean, I, I hope so. I, I don't know if he'll have a home though. That's the problem. But I do need more villagers. Yeah, let's let's talk to him too. Oh no. Okay, let's talk about the noble. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, I'll try to remember that Omir does not like the noble, okay? <laughs> I will try to remember that, but we got a new man, so that's pretty cool. I'm gonna go to the houses and see. Oh, these are the houses. Well, that's a family, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's us. <laughs> uh, this one's also gonna be a family with a baby, Kanuta. And this house here only has one man. Why don't you just go hang out with him? There we go. That should do. Uh, wait. Uh... Homeless guy? Where are you? Did that work? Yeah, something weird is going on. They either changed this or I'm going insane. But I, I think there's something going on. Either way, I'm going to cross the town here and go and try to pay my taxes. And we'll deal with him in the morning. Hopefully he won't abandon us by then. Okay, let's wake this guy up. I don't even feel bad. He's a bit of a jerk. <laughs> he can wake up. All right, we need we need to sell him this stuff. Uh, I've sold all my stuff. Still not enough money. This will only give me at least. Am I actually not going to have enough? Twenty nine forty one. Please tell me I can pay my taxes. I don't think so. Uh, what do I need? Twenty nine ninety. Oh no. Okay. Uh, let's see what else. Let's see what else. Maybe we can sell this one. Can I sell maybe my torch? Do I sell my backpack? Uh, that's too much. I think the water skin can go. Alright, and uh, maybe that would be enough. Oh, this is gonna leave me completely broke. Nope, still not enough. Twenty nine eighty three. Oh, I can sell my iron hammer. Okay. <laughs> It's fine. I, I should have another one at home. That's only selling for 10? Well, at least I can pay my taxes. I guess that's something. Oh, I hate him so much. I absolutely hate him so much. Just absolutely disgusting. Disgusting, man. Let's talk about the weather. That's usually pretty good. How's the job? He likes that. 
That's how the job is going again. And he's done. 65% though. That's not bad. He likes us. Emerald. Okay, let's see. Ah, uh, the noble is always... Ah, uh, he does not like talking about my day. Okay, that's fine. Let's talk to her. Have you been lately? Plus zero. No. Okay, let's talk about gossips. Oh, minus five. What a disaster. It was actually going so well. Alright, guys. No worries. This guy will be mine. Blissbore. The only problem I have right now is that, um, for some reason, my men are not sleeping together in the same house. I don't know what happened. They used to be able to roomie, and now they're not rooming. Um, I know they did something to the management system. I can tell. And, and my town is starting to get so large that I can't even, I can't even focus. I can't even make it happen. I'm trying to assign him a house. You can see I can select no building. Uh, that's not good. But there's only one guy living at certain... I, I don't understand, okay? But we'll assign a workplace at the very least. Okay, because there's nothing I can send him to do right now. Let's assign him over here as a miner. Just for now. And then I think Press is going to become our farmer eventually. Once I actually need him to farm. But for now, he's going to the mine. Alright, here we are on day three. Everything's looking great. A town is booming. We're doing fantastic, team. And I've added another house to the back of here. Uh, it is a bit different, I suppose. <laughs> it's just a little swervy compared to the other ones. But I think I kind of like the idea of it. I just think it's going to look really cool. I'm going to add this road right here. And hopefully, uh, initially I was thinking I would just go like this way with it. But uh, maybe just something more like this. So it goes straight. Mm. Yeah, maybe let's try this first. Let's try to make it go straight to the place here. Very nice. And so it'll just give me a bit of a different look. Everything around here is a little bit squaredy. And I don't want it to be like that. I want it to be a little bit more organic, so to speak. And I like where I place this. It's just by a little pond. Doesn't have a whole lot of yard, but I think eventually we could do something with some with some blocks around here. We'll figure it out. We'll make it work. We'll make it happen. Uh, there's room probably for one more small house right over here. And then we'll need to do something else. Uh, if you look over here, there's already the wall. So I'm going to add another house probably over here on the edge. And if there's room for a little house here, we will add it. If not, we'll turn this into maybe a little garden or something like that for our little neighborhood. But let me go ahead and build this house. This man is still homeless, so it's a bit bad. <laughs> it's just a bit bad. I have everything I need, though, to get it. I'm pretty sure I don't have to... I don't have to go farming too far, but I probably need to get some logs. It's so cool, guys. Look at the new sound. I love it. I absolutely love it. All right, house completed. Not bad, not bad. I mean, obviously we have to upgrade it. But let's go ahead and put this man in here before he actually leaves me. Uh, minus 49%, homeless, simple house. He's there now. Uh, my only problem is I have three simple houses. If you look over here with one person, I think they changed something. So this one over here has one person. This one has one and this one has one. This one is a small house, but it doesn't matter. The point being, there's only one human in it. So I think what it, what they've done is at least what I think they've done is they've made it so they can only be one male per home. So I think my best bet would be to start getting some females in here. If I don't, I'm going to have some trouble. Uh, otherwise, I'm gonna have to keep making houses. Uh, I don't, I don't understand it. It used to be fine. Now it's not fine. Let me know if it's just a bug I'm encountering or something weird. But you know, it, it's all possible. It's all possible. It's possible that it's just a bug, and I'm, I'm going a bit nuts. I'm going to go ahead and make a road to the edge here. Now this road looks weird going into there, but it, it's fine. It's fine. It, it will work out in the end. What I do want to finish though is the other road here that kind of disappeared. I have no idea why this happened, but, um, you know, I need it back. So we're gonna, we're gonna remake it. It's not a big deal. I just hope that I'm able to make it as well as I had it before. That's really my only concern. Um, 
I think... Maybe we make it in sections, okay? Uh, just to make sure we, <laughs> we have some success. So we're going to make it up to here. Which is going to be this section. Yeah, that's fine. And we're going to take it from here. And go... Uh, this is going to be a bit, a bit more risky. Yeah, yeah, we'll make it up to... Was this an even? No, no, no. It was not an even right there. Okay. We'll just keep going. Up to this. I think... That looks alright. This is sticking out on the other side. Uh, it always does a little bit, so I think it's okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's alright. I'm probably gonna remove this fence anyway and switch it to the rock one now that I'm able to make it, so why not? And over here, there's gonna be something else. So, uh, I don't mind it. I'm worried that I'm putting it too much into the road. But I don't think so. I don't think so, because you can see the road ends right there, where the, where, the, where the wall is right now. Okay, perfect. That will do, team. That will do just nicely. And the last thing I wanted to do today, I mean, uh, for the rest of the day, I'm basically just going to keep upgrading my house. But one of the things I want to do is I do want to make another pig pen. I'm basically all laying on the pigs, on the fertilizer and the food. Um, I really have no other way of making money. So it just seems like the best way to go about it. I'm going to grab, uh, I don't know how many logs I need to actually make this, probably like 12. And we have uh, plenty of manure since the last time. So very nice. Yeah, the pigs are, they're doing so well. They're doing such a good job of giving me money. Well, not money, fertilizer, which in turn will give me money in the future, at the very least. Uh, so we have a little pig pig family over here. And let's go ahead and make another one. We can make a goose house, but I don't have any money to buy any. And the only reason why the pigsty makes sense is because they are having babies. And the fact that they're having babies means that I'm going to be able to grow this without having to pay any more money. It's really what I'm, what I'm after here. Uh, so I'm going to plop this one back here. Um, maybe it would be nice if I could put it, like, right there. Wouldn't that be, wouldn't that be kind of neat? Oh, okay. Right there. It's not too bad. Uh, it is basically at the same level as the other one. Alright, whatever. Let's lay it down. Let's see what it looks like. Um, I like it. I mean, it's pretty lined up with the other one, and it's not really, uh, kind of blocking that one. It, lo it looks a little bit behind it, but I think I'm able to probably cut this off right here. Alright, so let me go grab some sticks. We're going to finish this off. I'm gonna bring it in up to there. Looks nice. Looks nice. And we just pretend that we're trying to save the tree. <laughs> I think that will work. Alright, that's good. That's good. And then it will connect these two. There we go. Very cool. Alright. Okay. It doesn't look too bad. Uh, they probably look better than the original sticks, but I'm honestly not sure. I don't super love them. I actually think the stick one probably looks better. Uh, yep, and this already needs blanks. <laughs> already not looking good. But the pig size shouldn't be too expensive to finish. It was really cheap to make in the first place. So let me just grab a few more sticks, a few more logs, and some straw, it looks like, for the roof. And we should be good to go. Oh. And another iron hammer. <laughs> we should be good to go. I am loving the new sound of constructing things. I think it feels really good. I love what they've done over here. With the sound especially for this. And for opening the chest. That sound is amazing as well. Alright, we're gonna need some straw for the roof. That's no surprise there. Uh, just making sure that I get all the logs that I need. Just a bunch of straw left. And I think that's it, team. Oh. Uh, let's get this done here. And they should be good. They shouldn't escape. So let me grab the straw. And then uh, we can break the other gate open. Alright, that's it. Pig side complete. Uh, I don't know if it needs to have any, any manure in there or any feed. I, I don't know if they've changed that. So I gotta make sure. It doesn't look like it. But I'm gonna take one animal feed out of there anyway. And bring it over here. You gotta keep an eye on the on the updates that they're doing because they certainly changed something to do with the workers 
And I don't want my piggies and all my town to start dying because I didn't feed them. Because I didn't know, if you know what I mean. But, oh. Oh, let's repair you. Uh, we gotta keep our house healthy. What is this? We're not shy at all about how many piggies we have and how many piggies we want. I think in the future, if I do decide to make a third piggy pen, I'm going to turn them sideways. So, you know how this one is facing kind of a, in a weird angle? We're going to turn it facing this way, and then both of them are going to be facing that way. And, you know, it's going to be like a little piggy community with four pigs. I, I think that's fine. That's fine. That's more than enough. We're going to have so many pigs. Uh, once we have babies, we'll decide what to do. We'll move them over there. But I do want to leave the male with as many females as possible to see if they produce a baby. You know, they have a chance, I guess, every season or whatever. And we'll see. More babies, more money, more piglets. Let's do it. All right, team, but I think that's going to be it for today. We have done a whole lot of building. Uh, certainly, we got a new worker, <laughs> a lot of farming. I'm just hoping this pays off in the end. For the rest of the day and night, I will just be picking up stone and I will be continuing uh, basically all our borders around here. We have so much to do. So much to do indeed. Um, it's just... It's just a lot. <laughs> I added a little bit of wall back there. I don't know if you can see. Because I was pretty sure that I wasn't going to add anything to that corner right there. Um, over here, I do want to add something. I just want to make sure that the building will fit. Because building on a slant is almost impossible. Otherwise, my plan is to probably remove this one here. And to hopefully add more farms to the back there. Remove that farm over there. Add more farms over here. And then I can use that space for something else as well. So lots of plans. Uh, <laughs> lots of plans and probably not enough time. But thank you so much everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed our spring adventure and I hope to see you guys on the next one. Until then. Bye.